Hello everyone and welcome to the Fusion 360 and Product Design Suite webinar. Recently, Fusion 360 was incorporated into your existing Product Design Suites on subscription. And this webinar is designed to illustrate how this benefit will be accessible to you and your users. Elizabeth Welsh will be narrating. Christina Davis and Crystal Rigetti will be our panelists to assist with any account access questions. And Nathan Chandler will be on hand to respond to any product-related questions for Fusion. Before we begin, please feel free to type questions in the chat window, and our panelists will answer them as time allows. This session will also be recorded, and a link to the slide deck will be available on the post-webinar survey. Now, I will be handing it over to Elizabeth Welsh to begin. Hi, everyone. Thanks for taking the time to attend today. As of January 30th, Product Design Suite customers on maintenance or desktop subscription are now entitled to Fusion 360 as part of their subscription benefits. Customers with Product Design Suite Premium now have Fusion 360, and customers with the Ultimate Suite will now have access to Fusion 360 Ultimate. This edition is free to you and will be included as long as your subscription contract remains active. This new functionality within Product Design Suite is intended to help integrate the design, engineering, and fabrication process in the cloud. You might be wondering how Fusion will be useful to you and your business. Fusion is a cloud-based CAD and CAM tool that integrates both mechanical and industrial design. Fusion allows for a comprehensive view of design process by the interplay between mechanical and electrical software, while also providing a low overhead collaboration tool between users. Here is a more in-depth look at how Fusion 360 will operate with your existing product design suite software. Fusion 360 uses Autodesk 360 Project Dashboard for data management and collaboration. Data can then be copied from A360 Drive to your A360 projects all in the cloud. We have also included a useful link in this slide that illustrates a step-by-step -step tutorial for how to transfer data from your product design suite software into Fusion via A360. Through Fusion 360, you will have access to Autodesk 360 projects. While close to 100 file formats can be uploaded into an A360 project, the 22 file formats below can then be converted into a Fusion 360 design. Both platforms act as collaborative tools in the cloud, and using Fusion 360 alongside A360 can function as a single repository for your team's designs. Fusion 360 uses a cloud-based translation server to convert the files into a Fusion 360 design. The below file formats can then be exported. If you want, you can even create a public link to share your designs with your team. We will now be moving on to a live demonstration of several scenarios, including the process a contract manager would take to access the benefit, assign a user, set permissions, and access the download. This is designed to help familiarize you with accessing this benefit and getting started. We will also include a brief overview of this process with screenshots after the live demonstration in case you would like to reference these steps in the future or send them to any other users. First, we will assign a user as the contract manager by navigating to the manage.autodesk.com page and signing in with the user ID and password. Next, we will want to make sure that we are under the management section of the account portal. Now, we can either click on manage users at the top right or navigate to the users icon on the left. To add a user, click the blue Add button on the top left, complete the fields, and click Save and Continue. When you click Save and Continue, 
you will be given the option to assign benefits to your new user immediately. However, as the contract manager, you may already have the seat automatically assigned to you. For desktop subscriptions, contract managers will automatically have a seat assigned to them upon completion of the purchase. In this case, we have a single seat of product design suite on the contract, so we will go through the process of unassigning it from the user, I mean from the contract manager, and allocating it to the new user. Without assigning the seat, your user will not be able to complete the installation of Fusion, as the permissions must be granted to their account. We will now navigate to the Edit Access button, expand the Product Design Suite line under Products and Services, where we will also find the Fusion 360 product, then uncheck the Assign box on the Contract line and click Save. A seat is now available. To assign this benefit to your new user, click Edit Access again, Expand the Products and Services line and assign the Fusion 360 entitlement along with any other services for your user. Please note that this will also consume a seat of your product design suite. It's important to ensure that you have also assigned download permissions above in the benefit section to have the product available as a download in their account. Next, we will log in as our new user to access the download. After logging in, we can see that Fusion is now readily available at the top of the screen for the user to begin the download. It is important to note that they will also be prompted to log in again with their user ID and password during installation. I'd also like to note that on the download screen, there is an orange box at the top right of the page that will direct you to chat with one of our Fusion support specialists in case any issues arise. For a step-by-step -step review of what we just covered, there are slides at the end of this presentation that will demonstrate logging in, the process of inviting a new user to your contract, and setting their permissions under products and services. This concludes the live demonstration of accessing Autodesk accounts and assigning Fusion 360. If you would like us to reach out to you for a one-on-one -on -one feedback session about the process of assigning this benefit, please feel free to request that we contact you in the post-webinar survey comments, or you can let us know by typing into the chat window, and we would be happy to follow up. As the contract manager or software coordinator, there are many resources available to you in case you experience any difficulty accessing your account, assigning Fusion, or using the product. You can review the FAQ, or email the Fusion team at support.fusion360 at autodesk.com. You can visit the Fusion 360 landing page where you can chat with Fusion support specialists, visit the community, or discover learning resources. In the download we started earlier, there is also an orange chat window at the top of the screen. You can also chat with our customer service team for account assistance by clicking Contact Us underneath the Support tab in your Autodesk account and choose Subscription Management in the first drop-down menu. There are a number of options for end users to contact support depending on the issue. For Autodesk account-related questions, they can chat with customer service representatives by navigating to the Contact Us page, which is linked here on the slide for your convenience. For product-related questions, they can also chat with Fusion Support Specialists on the Fusion Support page. However, the primary source of support is through our Fusion 360 community page, where you can post questions and interact with both expert users and Autodesk technical support. There is also a place on the Fusion community to post feature or enhancement requests and a blog for tips and tutorials to get you started. 
We have also made a link to a number of training modules available for your reference. Thank you for attending the Fusion 360 and Product Design Suite webinar. We are looking forward to helping you shape the future of design.